Well, the K-Wings' success on the road continues a decisive 7-2 victory here at the Bilo Center in Greenville, South Carolina. After a scoreless first period, Nick, we got to talk about the first tier. Um, three penalty kills for the Kalamazoo yeah. Wings, including a five-on-three. Only four shots surrendered, including one on, a fi on that five-on-three. When you're playing like that, it's going to be tough to beat teams. Well, I mean, they did have a few shots in the first period, but I think that really set the tone for the game. I mean, we did a great job killing those off and had great goaltending at the same time. So, you know, that set the tone for the whole game. Second period, how do you how do you describe it? Just, everything was clicking. Yeah, I mean, every time we had an opportunity to score, we scored. You know, and there, there, it's not like there was any cheesy goals. I think there was a lot of shots through traffic, and we were doing the right thing, supporting the puck, and and uh, what we were three for three on the power play. The guys did a great job. Daryl Bootlin is playing in a different hemisphere. Ah, uh, yeah, he's shooting the puck real well right now. And uh, line mates, you know that that goal they scored off the rush. You could hear the talk that they had Sirota to Trent, Trent to Booter, and Booter finishes it, and uh, it was a nice goal. Corey Carlander, a four point night. Every, I mean, you look down the stretch. Joe Charleboy, we mentioned his goal, but a plus four. Matt Tex, a plus four. Really tough to find any flaws in your game. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I felt that there was times in the game where we, we made a bad first pass out of our zone, and there's some things we can tighten up. You know, I, I don't think the, the second period was as good as it sounds. You know, I think we need to be a little bit better than that to win the next game. But uh, those are things we'll, we'll take the victory, and we're happy with that, and we'll work on those in the next couple days. Kalamazoo's outscored their opponents 11-2 to in the first two legs of this road swing. Riley Gill. Only just two goals against. Yeah, he's done a fantastic job the last two nights. He's, uh, he's really stood on his head for us and gave us a great opportunity to win. Third period, especially at the end, you expected them to send a message for Saturday night. Did they send a message? No, I think we did a great job. We stuck up for ourselves and uh, you know, we do things on our terms and our terms only. We have nothing to prove and that's what we did tonight.